The season finale of the Boston College Rebuild is finally here. We're going to knock out week 13, week 14. And I don't know if we'll knock out our buy, our uh, bowl game yet. We will see uh, what we do. Um, but we are going to play through week 12 and week 13, 14, definitely. Looking at the rankings, we are 5-5. Five and five. You need to have six wins to make a bowl game. So we have to win one of the next uh, two games. They're not that hard. You have uh, Virginia Tech, who's 5-5, five and five, and Syracuse, who's also 5-5. Five and five. So both teams fighting for a bowl game. We're going to qu- crush one of their dreams. Why don't we crush both of their dreams? Taking on hard. Um, as for uh, kick returns, kick returns are on. We got uh, Mike. We got Rice as our kick returner. Um, and there we go. We got Rice as our kick returner. And we're taking on the Syracuse Orange. I think we're going to rock the alternate, and they're just going to rock regular way. Taking on the Syracuse Orange right now. And we are kicking off Syracuse. It's a rainy one. Syracuse drives down the field, and they put a touchdown on the board. 7 nothing. Syracuse has the lead. Let's see what we can do. I'm hoping we can get some wins here. But we can, uh, we'll see. We'll see what happens, you know. Longest kick return. Uh, it's because I think it's the first time I've kick returned on the Boston College series. So uh, there, you're welcome, guys. Uh, Mike Rice makes a huge play. If we score on the first play, I am going to go nuts. We got to get this swipe over right here. This guy's coming. Get that swipe over. Perfect. Get that. Get that. Get that. Oh, 63 yards. What a play by Mike Rice. Handed off to Ben Quinn out of the backfield. Uh, honestly, Ben Quinn, you're, you're gone. We're it, like we we almost have to get a new running back. We will have to get a new quarterback. I really want to add a uh, decent running back, but I also want to add defense. So I'm not sure really what we're gonna do, but we'll see when we get there, which possibly could be the next video, depending on when we do the bowl game. But uh, we're gonna 15-8. Syracuse went down the field and scored and we're going to return this kick with Mike Rice he's going to take it out to about the 30 and he's going to get tackled down or dives for a gain about 30 and a half yards on that kick return Ben Quinn gets a gain of 4 and we are going to try to use a lot of a bunch of time here and uh, leave Syracuse it's like none or we can score really quick I mean I don't really know what preferred option is I we're probably just gonna end up scoring really quick because I am thought I'd be um, a little bit rusty with this team but you know what it's it's all back you know it's we're all it's all back uh, you know what else is coming back uh, Bears rebuild that that we're gonna have some Bears rebuild videos coming back um, of course we're gonna we're we're gonna keep giving you guys some who plan videos um, Bears rebuild Boston College rebuild um, what else do we have those are mostly what the next schedule is going to look like. Some Boston College, some Bears, some Hoopland. That's that's what the next schedule is going to really look like uh, for you guys. I want you guys to comment down below what Hoopland videos you guys want to see. I want you guys to comment down below. Do you want me to rebuild a certain team? Do you want me to play a certain player's career? I want you guys to comment that down below and let me know because I want to make videos that you guys want to watch. Uh, and uh, back to the game we are up 16 to 15 third quarter we got the ball to start the third quarter we got the wide receiver or tight end dan michaels um one of the greatest tight ends ever to set foot on retro college and mike rice gets a gain of 16 and we are uh, already knocking on their side of the field which is absolutely incredible um 14 hurt gain i love to see it absolutely love to see it Mike Rice making uh, making moves, and we are at the 25 yard line, 26 yard line. We if we can score, come on, Dan, come on, Dan, you can do this. 22 yard gain. I really want to score with Dan Michaels for some reason. I don't know why. I'm just feeling, I'm feeling Danny. I'm feeling Danny today. I just, I don't know why. Um, as he did score, and uh, Ben Quinn gets the two point conversion. 24 15 we have a nine point lead they drive down they score 22 to 24 two minutes left in the fourth if we lock this in if we get this win 
it takes a lot of pressure off because I know because then I know that hey you know if we win we we if we win this game we get a bowl game and that way I know that we don't have to win the next game it's not a must win if you know what I mean comeback route to the no name receiver oh that's right I am I want to get you know what I really quarterback is going to be my first pick or my first recruit I'm recruiting a quarterback with the with first then I think I'm going to recruit a defensive player then I'm probably going to recruit a offensive player um, which would probably be wide receiver. The wide receiver and the defensive player, I could switch them and go defense in the third uh, with my third recruit, but not sure yet what we're going to do with that one. I don't need an insane third receiver because I have Mike Rice. I have a good tight end. If we can just get somebody to you know catch the ball every once in a while, incomplete to the wide receiver, Mike Rice. Dan Michaels over the top. Just get the catch. Just get the catch. There we go. 15-yard <clears throat> gain. We are hopefully going to be knocking on the door as uh, Mike Rice gets a nice catch there. And he gets 13 yards. We uh, are now currently leading, which is very nice. 30 to 22. I missed the extra point, so they have a chance to send it to overtime. Oh my gosh. They, 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 they got stopped. Hallelujah. No overtime. We don't have to do overtime. We stopped them. Boston College takes down uh, Syracuse, and we are now a bowl eligible team. We absolutely killed it out there. Four touchdowns, two hundred, almost three hundred yards. I mean, we we absolutely destroyed it out there. Virginia Tech. We're gonna have to go with. Uh, we're gonna go all white. Virginia Tech is gonna go home. We're gonna go all white. You know. We're going to rock all white. They're going to go home. Taking on Virginia Tech, they have a one-and-a-half star offense, so they should not score very much. They should probably be a team that doesn't score a lot, hopefully, here, and we can just cruise right through this team. You know, If we could just dominate this team and show why we should get a half-decent bowl game, I mean, a 7-5 to five team doesn't get that good of a bowl game, but I mean, I would take any bowl at this point. Just to get in a bowl game would be a, a nice, would be nice. Uh, I want to go to Dan Michaels here. I feel like James Daniels got a lot more arm strength. And the greatest tight end in Retro Bowl is back. I mean, come on. That that man is in absolutely incredible. I just cannot fathom how good that Dan Michaels is. He's not even that good of a, like, star-wise, like, rating-wise, he's not even that good. But somehow, he manages to just score touchdowns to just score touchdowns and just make insane plays. He, he just manages to do it somehow. And I accidentally ran the ball, and Ben Quinn just got exploded. That's annoying, as it is now 7-6. to six. Virginia Tech has a one-point lead with 30 seconds remaining on the clock. And we should hopefully walk away with this uh, good lead in the first half. If we can be leading in the first half, I'm confident that we win this game. Dan Michaels over the top gets the catch. <clears throat> Did you see how many guys he just stiff armed? There's three guys laying on the ground. I mean, come on. Dan Michaels is the guy. Like he I I, I mean, this guy just deserves the spotlight after spotlight. The only YouTube short I've posted on my channel was of him, and I might make another one of him from that good play that happened earlier. Um I I mean he's just insane. He, he's insane. It's in, it's incredible. I love to see it. Comeback route. He's wide open. Why not? I mean, I mean, dude, he just, he's so good. You can just stop on a dime and just juke the crap out of the corners and he's gone. Put him on ice skates. He's gone. And the no-name receiver, he's going to get a touchdown. Uh, a little bit shocking there. But uh, we're going to get a touchdown any way we can as it's 12-7. to 7. We currently have a nice little lead here, which... And Virginia Tech punts the football. I assumed that was going to happen. I assumed it was going to happen. As the greatest tight end ever just continues to be amazing. I mean, come on. Th this guy. I mean, this this guy. D seriously. Like, you guys are probably comment my tight end's better. I've gotten that comment before. Seriously, guys. That is the greatest tight end. I mean, come on. Tell me that there's a better tight end out there. This guy breaks tackles after tackles after tackles. It's unbelievable. 
and and he scores a touchdown and, and puts the guy right right on his face. Dan Michaels, you are you are amazing. You are absolutely incredible. You're, you're amazing. I, I love you, Dan Michaels. Twenty-two to seven, Georgia Virginia Tech puts a touchdown on the board, misses the extra point, so it's twenty-two thirteen. They currently cannot uh, take the lead. Uh, they are down by nine, so they cannot tie it. It's a two-score game, which I love to say that word, two-score game, when it's obviously not us. We're up by two scores. We love it. When we're down by two scores, not so good. Comeback route, Mike Rice gets the catch. Dude, keep your feet in bounds, please. Actually, you know what? That was on the quarterback. That was a bad throw. Um, talking about a bad throw, I throw an interception. Doesn't matter because Virginia Tech drives down the field. They, and we're still winning by two, even though they score a touchdown. 22 to 20. We are just absolutely having a, uh amazing game, other than the interception, obviously. As there are seven seconds remaining in the third quarter, Dan Michaels gets a nice catch. Gets a gain of nine, and that's going to end the third quarter. The final quarter is coming up, and the, this is the last quarter of the year one of the rebuild with uh, Boston College. Hope you guys enjoyed this uh, this uh, first season. I'll tell you what, next season is going to be a lot better because we're going to actually have a chance to make a uh, a run because we will have a better quarterback, we will have a better receiver a better number two receiver, and a quality defense. You guys are going to want to tune in for next year. Next year is going to be amazing. You guys are going to want to tune in. And I, Dude, if I soiled this game because I was rambling on and I wasn't focused, if I lose this game, I might have to delete my channel. I mean, come on. Look at Mike Rice. He's running down there like crazy. All right, if we got to... We gotta play some, play some classical music. Play something that's really nice to the ears. This is gonna be a perfect, perfect drive. Play some nice music. Nice kick return there. Comeback route. There we go. There we go. That's a that's a good comeback route. Fifteen yards, my my Christ. We got it. And we also got that. There we go. 27 seconds. I want to use a timeout, but I want to also conserve my timeouts. So I'm not quite sure when to use a timeout. Oh my gosh, she's so slow. Get out of bounds. Get out of bounds. I've got two more plays. Put it up here. Put it up. There we go. There we go. Eight seconds. One more play and a timeout and then another play. Dan Michaels, Dan Michaels, Dan Michaels, Dan Michaels. Get that catch. Get that catch. Huge, huge, huge. One, one second left. I barely got that timeout off. One second. Mike Rice on the streak for the game. Can he get it? Can he secure the win? Yes. Yes. Come on. Give me. Give me that W. I'll take it all day. I'll take it all day. Give me the W. Give me that W. No time on the clock. We win 30 to 26 in Virginia. We don't even get to play our home stadium. We get the win. 55th or we 55 in the final final rankings and uh, LSU USC Ohio State Michigan usual sus suspects you know top players from each conference Oregon Illinois kind of a shocker Miami a shocker Notre Dame Clemson Troy a big shocker as Campbell Coach Campbell Mike Campbell the son or no was it was this one Josh Campbell I'm sorry Mike Campbell is the Bears coach we got Josh Campbell. The guy, Josh Campbell, age 37, pretty good, pretty good. Um, we got it, guys. ACC Championship, Clemson, Miami. Who's winning it? Miami wins the ACC Championship. They might make a run to the playoffs, honestly. Let's see here, Sunbelt. SEC, LSU beats Florida. LSU's in the playoffs. Utah beats USC. Wonder if USC doesn't make the playoffs anymore. Big 12, Texas beats TCU, Penn State beats Illinois, and uh, there we go, here we go, guys, did we make, uh, or who made the playoffs, who made what bowl games, here we go, LSU, Miami gets the two seed, Ohio State and USC, Michigan is the odd team out, they unfortunately do not make it, and wow, what a season for us, 
as uh, we had a heck of a game <clears throat> as Army Navy game celebration bowl. It's time to see what bowl game we will be playing in. Here we go, Army Navy. <sighs> Here we go. What bowl game are we going to be playing in? I'm just going to skip through these. I don't really care who wins the celebration bowl. Guaranteed rate bowl versus Oklahoma. What is Oklahoma even ranked? Holy smokes. Oh, is What is Oklahoma? 24. We get to play in a top 25 team. Extreme. We're playing that game on extreme. Top 25 Oklahoma. Wow, that's going to be a great game. And I will see you guys in that video. Which will be the next video. Guaranteed rate bowl. I guarantee you guys that that's going to be a good bowl game. A good video. We will see you guys there. I think I'm going to film that video right after this video. I'm going to release those videos, and you guys should enjoy those. We'll see you guys in the bowl game. Who's excited? Comment below if you're excited. Also, comment below what other videos you want me to do and who planned. We'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.